So folks, we're back in the long drive, and you know what? I've found something. And it's something that I think we're gonna take advantage of. So, I love this RV. Uh, it's an awesome mod, a very cool build. We've been with this thing for weeks, but it's time for a change because I have found another army truck. And folks, we're gonna get revenge for all the Maxwells that have been destroyed and captured in this world. Um, we're gonna ignore the whole fact that I might have destroyed a couple of them. But I feel like we need a change of scenery here. Uh, we've been with that thing for long enough, and I really wanna make a tricked out army truck here. So there's still plenty of spots for Maxwells inside of here. It's got a really strange seat, and we've found this thing once. Uh, at a garage and I found it again. I was like, you know what? We're probably not gonna see it ever again or at least for like a month and Maybe by that time the mod might be broken I'm not saying because the, the mod creators fault, but the game updates and sometimes stuff just doesn't get updated with it So we're gonna take advantage of this. It needs a little bit of cleaning up. It's obviously a rusty poo right now, but uh, We're gonna do this. I I'm gonna take the leap of faith here. We're gonna dive right in. Come on Maxwell uh, we got a new home, buddy. I already know there's going to be some people upset about this, but you know what? We, we got to adventure. You know, we can't just do the same thing over and over. Uh, we got to take advantage of things, uh, opportunities when you see it. This is like a, a motivation for real life, too. Like, like if you have an opportunity, just go do it. Uh, do the thing. Uh, unless it's something stupid and you're going to get hurt doing it. Then don't do the thing, but do the thing if it's something cool. Uh, all right, kitties, come on. Let's load up. I'm going to take whatever I can. Uh, no matter. Oh, jeez. I was gonna say no Maxwell's left behind. Is there physics lock in this thing? I would think that there is. Uh, I have it on in the game. I think this vehicle here, the, the big RV, since it was a mod, uh, it didn't actually lock fully in the back. But I feel like this is the normal vehicle, the normal truck. It just has a, a machine gun. Is that a 30 cal or a 50 cal? Not really sure. But yeah, uh, we're gonna armor this thing up. Shall we stick a V8 motor in there? Actually, oh, I bet you diesel's in the tank. Okay, did confirm there's diesel in the tank. Maybe we'll stick with the diesel motor for now. Uh, we could always find a V8 down the road. Uh, maybe we'll soup this thing up, but I think it needs to be armored up. And look, we even have some fresh rubber to put on this thing. Uh, yeah, these tires are in terrible shape. But yeah, if you guys are enjoying the long drive on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, I know, like I said, some people are gonna get oddly mad. But we need something different. We need to do something, like, cool. Uh, by the way, I think it's a rear-wheel drive, so let's go ahead and put the fresh rubber in the back. I hear a rabbit. Where? Oh my goodness! Oh, that scared me! Come on, come on, get, get a weapon, get a weapon. Wait, did they both just die on a box? Oh! <laughs> Dude, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda jumped there. Like, I was wondering where it was, and then, turn and there's two killer bunnies in my face. I need to go, like, uh... Wait, is it drinking blood that refills my health? Uh, something like that. Anyways, get some fresh rubber on the back. Uh, I'm sure there's some brushes in this stop. By the way, we found another diner. Uh, so that's cool. Also, there's probably another tire in here. Uh, but I did have some good tire. Like, the wheels themselves are not good, but the rubber's decent on these. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, at least we carry some of this. So it was a good thing that we had all this mounted to the RV. There we go. Just need one more good tire. Uh, do we have any brushes? Oh, there's another V8 motor back here. Uh, okay, there's a brush. Um, there's a new tire. Holy man, that one's in really good shape. All right, so we have fresh tires on this. So yeah, as long as we armor this thing up, I'm going to put some like attachments to it. Make it look really cool. And we're going to call our original Maxwell. It's going to be Commander Maxwell. Maybe we'll mount him to the roof. Like he's our lookout. <laughs> I kind of wish he can control the gun. That would be honestly really awesome. All right, let's clean this up. Folks, you want to see something satisfying? Watch this. Uh-huh. Just scrape it. Oh. Oh, wait, it's blue? <laughs> okay. Oh, we already wore out this one. All right, there's probably another one inside. Uh, let's go check. Uh, normally in the kitchen. Uh, by the way, I may or may not have killed somebody. Um, yeah, to get this. Th to be fair, they said something about eating my eyeballs. So, I mean, that, I take that as a threat. All right, here we go. Watch this. Wait for the shine. Oh, my goodness. Uh, we got one more layer of shine here, I think. Right? It should shine up one more. Actually, it doesn't look like the suds are going. Uh, all right, hold on, we need to scrape the door. Yeah, I, I don't know if I like the blue. I feel like that blue is not a very in intimidating blue. What is this? This is a oh, white. Well, that's not any better. Uh, it's kind of like an orange here. I, I feel like that's, I mean, that's a decent color. 
Like, oh wait, do I still have any paints attached to the side of the RV? Like, do I have like a red somewhere? Um, I don't know. All right, let's hold on. Let's use the cleaner real quick. Uh, spray this down a couple times. Come on. I know it shines up more. There it goes. I was waiting for that. I was about to say, I know it shines up more than this. Okay, come on, door clean up. There we go. Got that one. And we got one more door here. Uh, if I got more spray, that would be perfect. All right, so we've wasted those. Also, there should be more sponges. Hmm. What do we... Oh. <laughs> Better not forget Jimmy. Uh, I'm only going to take original Jimmy. Actually, oh, Jimmy is... Yeah, I forgot. Jimmy's lodged into here. I don't think I can get... Hold on. Let me try attaching him on the outside. Uh, come on. C come on, Jimmy. Come on. Um, you know, should we just set Jimmy... Oh, on. On. He might be coming out. There we go. There's Jimmy. Okay, I need to get the other one out because I think the other one's the original one, but we're going to take one of the Jimmys. Uh, the other Jimmy can be free and... I don't know. Frolic through the desert. Is that what Jimmys do? Yeah, just frolic through the desert. Not going to lie, this is actually a pretty good color for it. It's kind of tan. So it's like camoed with the desert, so we can sneak up on like people that steal Maxwell's. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna go with that excuse. Uh, come on, come on, paint. I think that one just needs to be shined up. Hans, paint the trunk real quick. Still not big on the color, but I mean, it makes a little more sense than being like baby blue uh, <laughs> driving through the desert. Uh, there we go, that's pretty nice. Well, just as I say that, look at this green. Dude, that is a bright green. Uh, you know what? We're gonna keep this. I might paint it this, but hold on. Let's just stick this to the side. There we go. Um, well, I mean, that kind of works, too. So, things that I'm not taking, I, I don't... I mean, the Maxwells, they like their TV, I would imagine. Uh, maybe they like cartoons, but, uh, until I find a logical solution for that, we are not gonna take those. Uh, let's put that on the back. Uh, I feel like that's just not a thing. Uh, oh, I bet you these are just normal gasoline. Oh, that one's actually empty. Yeah, we'll take that because uh, as soon as I find some diesel, I'm going to need to fill up. Uh, so we'll attach this to the side. Not going to lie, this is looking pretty sweet so far. I need to find something to do with the grill, though. Like, the grill needs to look mean. Like, it's an army truck. I need to be able to run stuff over. Hold on, let's mount one of these baskets up here. All right, that looks pretty good. To be honest with you, I could still take a tur- Well, I might be able to take a turbo. I don't know. They're in really odd spots. Uh, I do want to use uh, the overhead lights. I feel like those would be a nice addition to the top of it. And other than that, just got to fill it up with some gas. Uh, I feel like we'll be in pretty good shape to get going here. Okay, one of the final upgrades. I'm going to go ahead and stick a turbocharger. Just a, a single one. Oh, that radiator's bad. Um, on. We can take this out. I got a good one here in the RV. There we go. Look at this big boy. All right. Let's shove this down. Oh, and I got the mount button there for a second. Oh, oh, on. Uh, wait, where is it? Where is it? It's gotta be. There it is. Boom. All right. Under the hood is complete. <laughs> look at that. Also, oh, look at Jimmy riding up there. Uh, we're gonna call it Captain Jimmy now. All right, folks. Well, the time has come. Uh, editor, please kick in with the sad music now. Uh, we gotta do it. I do this for all my vehicles. It, we we kind of just call it like a funeral. <laughs> no, it sounds bad. Hold on. Let me push the rear. Oh, there it goes. There goes the R. I hope I don't have anything that I actually need on that. Uh, on. It needs a bigger push. <laughs> uh, normally, I do this on a bigger hill. Hold on. I got this. I got this. Here we go. Uh, and we say goodbye. Bye, Mr. RV. Okay, so we're good to go. Let's uh, search out the remaining of this, and we're going to get going in our... Oh, my goodness. What is going on up there? Um, that is a full-blown traffic jam. Okay. All right, Maxwell's, we ready to go? Uh, let's do this. Crank it up. Yep. Fires. Sounds a little strange. No, I think that's normal. It's been a while since I've been in one of these with a normal motor. All right. Uh, looking good. Oh, yeah. I forgot about this traffic jam. Oh. <laughs> also, my radiator totally pokes out, uh, pokes out of the, uh, the top. I didn't know that. I guess I have the really big one. Man, this traffic sure is in the way, isn't it? Hold on. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah, buddy. Oh, that is so cool. On. Oh, I have the popping tires mod still. By the way, I don't think this runs out of ammo. So we can go up to like a haunted house and just light the whole thing up. Duck, Jimmy. Watch out. Oh, might have hit Jimmy in the back of the head. Um, wait, what is that? Um, I hear uh, a police siren behind me. How do I get out of this thing, by the way? Which way do I need to aim? I think the police are coming. They might be angry as to what I just did. Uh, no, I, I got this. I, I got this. I know how to get out of this. There's probably like a specific spot, right? Okay, yeah, just look straight up. Um, yeah, I think the cops are coming. We might want to just go ahead and get out of here. Uh, yep, all right, let's get moving. 
By the way, there's a, a good spot here to the right of me that I could probably do something cool with. Uh, yeah, it's definitely not van life anymore, but it is now army truck life. Oh, this is so cool looking. Also, I still want to do something to the front of this. Um, I don't know what that's going to be, but uh, I want like a big bumper. Maybe we can find a bumper off like a Fury or something. Uh, also, I have a turbo. Oh, it's moving. Yeah, I don't hear the turbo noise. Uh, I might need to put it back in the manual. I have issues with manual, like on certain cars. Uh, so, oh, there goes another cop. All right, they must have not been after me. Uh, it's fine, though. We're, we're just going to pretend like they were after me, and that justified me uh, shooting the roadblock. Oh, listen very closely. The turbo is spooling up. Nice. So we're getting a little bit of a boost. Maybe we shouldn't put a V8 in here. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, because Komodo can barely control his vehicle anyways. So V8 might be just a bad option. What does that sound? Oh, my goodness. Come on, police. Leave me alone. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. We're getting super aggressive. Uh, am I really not that fast? I thought this motor was decent in this. Oh, and turbo is spooling back up. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're starting to go fast. He's really bumpy over here. Uh, by the way, I'm not going to put bus tires on this. I know somebody's going to be like, Komodo's going to put bus tires on this, isn't he? No, we're not doing that. Uh, this vehicle, I don't think, would do well with that. Uh, the RV, honestly, was really good with the big bus tires, but this one, probably not so much. I feel like it's going to be too tall off the ground, and it probably would flip. Even with the uh, suspension mod adjuster, uh, I don't think I could set this thing right to make it not be miserable to drive. Right, Actually, right now, it's pretty pleasant. Uh, not the fastest vehicle, but I I'm enjoying it. Uh, oh, it's a tanker. I, I thought maybe we were coming up to a haunted house. I was about to say, um, shall we go have some fun? Maybe uh, lure the, uh, the locals out of the house. Also, can't confirm by looking at the back of this, the Maxwell Cats have not moved at all. So the physics lock is properly working on this vehicle, which is good. Because, uh, yeah, I got to keep my kitties. I also have kitties in the front here, too. Um, oh, it is getting dark. Oh, you know what I just realized? Uh, how have I just realized this? Uh, the mirrors, they're rusty on this. I, I thought maybe the mirrors would clean up with the doors, but I guess they don't. So I need to get another brush and uh, brush those off. I mean, the rest of the vehicle's in decent shape. I need more spray uh, to shine the rest of it up. Uh, also, it is getting really dark. Uh, I don't see any stops coming up, which is kind of odd. Also, uh, wait, could we shoot the UFO? Uh, can you destroy that thing? I, I almost wonder. Like, I would love to see, like, an RPG mod. Oh, here we go. We got a gas station on the left side. Uh, all right, let's cross. Oh, my goodness. The brakes work so much better on this vehicle. Who would have thunk that, you know, a, uh, a giant vehicle is hard to stop and something small is easier? Oh, oh, here we go. Han. Hey, buddy. Uh, I, got a, I got a surprise for you, uh, Han. Han. It's a little bit of an inconvenience to get in here. Uh, hi, I'm not afraid. Uh, oh, sorry, Jimmy. <laughs> it, it's fine. Jimmy could take a couple shots to the back of the head. <laughs> now that I think about it, maybe Jimmy is not mounted in a great spot. <laughs> I'm sorry, Jimmy. Uh, it's fine. He's got a thick skull. Um, that is satisfying. Oh, that should have been a Maxwell cat. Dang it. All right, well, let's, uh, let's bust open the crate. Maybe we'll find another one in here. Uh, we're rescuing the cats via army truck. No, it's just balls. Well... That's not really what I wanted. We got a bumper here. Will this bumper mount? This bumper looks... Actually, this is a rear bumper, I think. Or is this the front bumper? Hold on. Uh, attach. Can I mount it to the front and make it look a little bit more like a... Hold on, let's go like maybe that. So it gives us a little more surface. That actually is really sideways. I uh, thought maybe that would look cooler. Hold on. Maybe if I can if I can get it to set right... Hold on, I'm going to press it against it. Uh, boom. It's also really dark. It kind of gives us a little bit more bumper. I, I still feel like there's something else that we can do to the front of this. Um, you know, we should probably stop here for the night. I don't think driving... Actually, that glow's really bright. Yeah, I don't think driving around uh, is too good of an idea. All right, kill it. Uh, let's go for a little bit of a nap here. All right, so we're back on the road. I really would like to find a red uh, on this. I got a green. I kind of feel like... Man, that's kind of a really aggressive-looking green. I think green would work for an army truck, too. I mean, the tan honestly makes the most sense, because uh, look at how I kind of blend in with the desert. But I, I still want, you know, I actually want people to see me coming, because they're going to fear this army truck. Um, totally, right? I mean, it does have a big gun on the back of it. Uh, I, that would scare me, definitely. Oh my goodness. That was, the big, <laughs> that was one of the biggest launches I've ever seen from an AI car. <laughs> oh, that was glorious looking. Oh, 
Thankfully, our car doesn't do that. I, I know we're not like loading in like they do, but like, could you imagine if that was like a random glitch and he would just fly up to the sky? Uh, honestly, it would be kind of funny, but yeah. So not gonna lie, I'm enjoying the road trip a little bit more right now because I don't feel like I'm like near death uh, when I'm driving this thing. Uh, to be fair, the RV was a tank. Is that another? Oh, and that might be another diner up there. Dude, that'd be kind of cool. Like, I would love to get multiple diner stops. Those are uh, the best ones. Watch out, bunny! Oh my goodness, that one almost just crossed the street right in front of us. Uh, okay, let's go up here. Come on. Uh, you know what I'd like to see in the game? Oh, oh my. Okay, that one's definitely better than the first one. Okay, go under it, go under it, go under it, go under it! Oh! What are the odds of a car landing on you in the desert? Like, somebody please explain that to me. I think those were those were all his parts, right? Yeah, I don't... I don't see anything on mine that's gone. As I was saying, yeah, I, I really like seeing de uh, diner stops, but a feature I would like to see in the game, oh, that isn't a diner. Uh, I would love to see hordes of, uh, say, the mutants. Uh, maybe some variation too, since they all look the same. Like, uh, could you imagine arriving at a stop and like 10 of them come out and just start chasing the vehicle? Um, hold on, we gotta park out here. I gotta strategically place my gun. Wait, why is the... We're not going to talk about what just happened. Okay. We're going to turn around. And we're going to go back this way. Uh, I was not paying attention to the fact that the poles were on the left side of the road. I was like, why is the door open on this? I've been here before. Oh, my goodness. You know what's bad is we're going to pass by the diner again. And we're going to see probably the RV. Uh, I wonder how long people were screaming at the screen seeing that the poles... Actually, did anybody notice that? Like, be honest. Don't just sit there and say, oh, yeah, I noticed it, Komodo. Like, comment down below. Did you notice that the poles were on the wrong side of the road? All right. You know what I could do? I think I saved my uh, game. I'm just going to load it up and turn around. Hey, look what's rolling off. <laughs> wait, is somebody driving that right now? Um. Wait, what is happening? Like, it seriously looks like the thing's wide open and it's just driving. Wow. Did, did one of the mutants steal it? Okay, so we're back going the right way. You know, this is one of those games where I get in a really relaxed state when I record it. it since there's not really a whole lot going on and you're just kind of driving around, uh, you kind of zen and zone out and that's totally what just happened there and I just wasn't paying attention. Hey, but it's fine. Uh, we got to shoot some things. Uh, we just watched our RV take off full speed going the other way. Uh, like, I seriously think the throttle was hung there. Like, when I loaded it back up, it was just driving. It wasn't even just sitting there. Man, that would have been something if you load up a save. Oh my goodness. Uh, if you load up a save and like you just, your vehicle just takes off on you. Uh, thankfully, I don't think that's a very common thing. All right, well, we're heading the right way now. I do see a ton of haunted houses, so maybe we could stop off at one of those. Okay, here we go. Look at this. We have a haunted house in front of us. Do you think we could get their attention by shooting the house? Like, I think we can. We just got to open up the front gates. We'll drive the army truck in and, you know, uh, do a little bit of shooting. I, I think that'll work pretty good. Oh my goodness, it is getting laggy. What is loading in over here? Uh, I would laugh as if it's another army truck. No, I just see a couple normal vehicles outside. Okay. Uh, we know there's people in here, right? So we're just going to pull around here. And uh, we're just going to... Wait, can I knock those open? No, that needs to be a feature too. Like, big gates like that, it'd be cool if you could just, like, plow the room. Okay. Uh, we're just going to get their attention here. Uh, open that up all the way. Uh, we're going to make a lot of noise out here. And they should hopefully come out the front door. I might need to open the door for them. Sometimes they're a little stupid. Okay. Let's just turn it off. Okay. Do we hear anybody in there? Huh. Not going to lie. It's, it's oddly quiet. Hello? Is anybody in here? Oh. Okay, there indeed is somebody in there. Okay, uh, noisemakers. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. Why don't we? Uh, here we go. <laughs> Just light up the whole house real quick. Too bad you couldn't blow out the windows. I uh, saw so that mutant totally didn't run out. Uh, oh, sorry, Jimmy. Uh, there's a chance I might have hit him in the back. I don't know if the bullets penetrate through the wood here. Uh, yeah, but we're gonna go ahead and just light up the whole thing here. Not gonna lie, this is super satisfying. Okay. Uh, are they dead? 
Or are they just stupid? Did he? He's not dead. Okay, can't confirm, can't shoot through that. Okay, well, I thought I was going to be Mr. Intimidating uh, going in here. Hey, why didn't you come out? What? What's wrong with them? Uh, is there more in here? Hmm. Well, there's a lot of loot in here. We can at least deal with that. I don't hear anybody else in here. Kind of odd for it to be this empty, right? Hold on, let's turn on the light. Hello? Uh, hold on, look at the pictures. Okay, so we have the bats that are all over the houses, and then we have a random street. Yeah, I like to look at the pictures because I feel like there's some lore built into these. Uh, anybody in here? Lots of loot in here. Uh, what about the kitchen? Sometimes there's people in the kitchen. Hello? Huh. It is really empty. Oh, can... You know, this is the first time I've realized that you can actually open the cabinet doors. I am stupid. Wow. Okay, we're going to use some tunes to break open some of these crates. Uh, we're on the rescue mission for Maxwell's here. Uh, so we're just going to go Hold on. Oh, I might be able to hit multiple things here. Boom! That was pretty good. Uh, on, let's grab that back. Oh, what's in here? Uh, you can still what's see in here. I think it's food. Uh, it's weird that you can throw those crates and they won't break. Yet, you can just launch a radio at them and it's like devastating. Uh, it doesn't really make a whole lot of sense as far as the destruction physics, but it's fine. Uh, it totally was food. Like, who keeps a box of croissants? Is that is that a common thing? Uh, oh, there goes that one. Yeah, I don't think there's any Maxwells in here. Oh, and I, I could somewhat see into these now. Uh, do I see any Maxwells in there? Uh, launch this at it. Nope, oh, no Maxwells. Oh, bunch of sweet sunglasses. And, uh, and a basket. Well, there's some things that I could probably take out of here. It's really laggy. Here we go. But, oh, apparently I can't throw that very, uh, very hard. Oh, not, not in there. I could see into these somewhat too. That is that cactus? Why is there cacti in there? Wait, does this thing break crates? Okay, it's really odd that the soccer ball can do it. Wait, what about, is this cheese? Uh, yep, that's cheese. Definitely can confirm, breaks that. Uh, I hear a rabbit outside. Nah, it's fine. So yeah, I need to search this thing out a little bit more. You know what we're gonna try real quick? I'm gonna try this green paint. Uh, I kind of feel like this paint is gonna look good. Huh? Oh, okay. Not gonna lie, this is pretty cool looking. Like, this is the green I was hoping it was going to be. I was hoping it wasn't going to be, like, too loud, but definitely doesn't look like a, a soft green. It's like, this kind of looks a little bit like an army green. Oh, yeah, I like that. It also kind of looks like the Incredible Hulk. We now have a green army truck. That's pretty cool. But, yeah, I'm going to search the rest of us out, hopefully find some more Maxwells. If you guys have any suggestions for this build, comment down below.